Just three days before Independence Day, India will launch its most advanced geo-imaging satellite. The satellite will launch on August 12th at 5.43 a.m. from Sriharikota Spaceport. GISAT-1 was supposed to launch on March 28, 2021, but ISRO had to postpone it to April and then to May due to a SIM issue. And, when the second wave of COVID-19 hit states where ISRO operates, the launch of the satellite was further delayed. What is GISAT's purpose? The 2,268-kilogram 2 GISAT-1 will be launched into Earth's geo-orbit by ISRO's GSLV F-10 rocket. EOS-3 is GISAT-1's code name. This advanced, eye in the sky, will be able, to continuously monitor areas of interest, such as the country's borders, especially with Pakistan and China. EOS-3 will be able to image, the entire country four to five times per day, once it is placed 36,000 kilometers above the Earth's surface, in geostationary orbit. Unlike other sensing satellites that are placed in lower orbits, can only cover areas at regular intervals, EOS-3 will provide real-time information about a large area. GISAT-1 will aid in the rapid detection of natural disasters, as well as episodic and short-term events. The satellite will also enable monitoring of water bodies, crops, vegetation conditions, and forest cover changes. According to the report, GISAT-1 will have six-band multispectral visible and near-infrared imaging sensors with 42 meters of resolution, 158 bands hyperspectral visible and near-infrared imaging sensors with 318 meters of resolution, and 256 bands hyperspectral shortwave infrared imaging sensors with 191 meters of resolution. And, according to ISRO's statement, for the first time, an O-give-shaped, payload-fairing, heat shield, with a diameter of 4 meters, was used in the rocket. What is the next missions of ISRO? After the GISAT-1 launch, the other satellite, to go up will be EOS-4 or, Radar Imaging Satellite 1A. Which is a radar imaging satellite with synthetic aperture radar, that can take pictures, at any time of day or night, and see through clouds. This satellite, weighing over 1,800 kilograms, will be launched by a PSLV in September. With its ability to operate day, night, and in all weather conditions, the satellite will play a critical role in the country's defense. The small satellite launch vehicle or mini PSLV will make its first developmental flight from Sriharikota in the fourth quarter of this year. Following that, the first crewed mission, Gaganyan, is scheduled to launch in 2023 on ISRO's GSLV MK3.